Okay, so I hope everybody enjoys this. It's free 10 in the morning, as you guys see right here. I don't mind this. The screen recording thing, that was a test video I made. So this is going on my main channel. Evan R. Game Man is my second channel for my gaming streams and stuff like that. Well, not gaming streams, but you know what I mean. The... Is my charger straightened? Yeah, it is. I really should just take this thing off charge before I start recording, so why not? Hope you enjoy my ruby wallpaper. Two best girls. Uh, and we're going to be reading a season 5 episode 14 true friendship. It's a My Little Pony story. I'll, I'll give you, I'll give you this. I do enjoy My Little Pony. I'm not a brony whatsoever. Don't even say that. But, I do enjoy My Little Pony. Uh, it's it's pretty it's decent. It's decent. Uh, also, my... Hold on, let me type... Evan R. Game. Man, I probably screwed that up. This channel's only for my PlayStation games. Like, right here. So, if I'm gonna do a reaction to... If you guys want me to react to, like, anything, I will. Like, look, we can, we can do a reaction to my... My video. L look at me. Look at me beat up Batman with Taz. It's sick. Okay. Also, I just want to make, mention this before we get into the season five, so fourteen true friendship story. Any of these games requests an app, I will upload it. It's like I could do. I could do Mortal Kombat. I could do Subway Surfers. I could do uh, Dr. Mario. I can do Candy Crush. I can do Simpsons. Uh, I can do any other thing. What well, if a PewDiePie game on here? I don't understand. Uh, I think I just wanted to try it out. I never played it. Any of these apps I can do. I'll probably do like a Looney Tunes thing or something. I don't know. I just wanted to try this out. But my main, main channel. The only thing I have on here is this test video. Which is nothing. I think it's like 11 seconds long. And that was just something I wanted to do. So just lay back. I'm going to shut the music off. Because you know this is like annoying. Like just music. I don't want no no noise. If, oh hey, what's up? Is that Kevin Picard? If you hear the noise in the background, it's freaking air heater. So apologies. Let's apply. Yeah, oh yeah, we're gonna get some ads. All right, let's see. I've seen this done like a long time. I always wanted to do like horror story stuff. All right, sit back, relax. Oh, Equestria Girls movie. I just watched all those like not too long ago. <clears throat> And at the end of this, I will give my thoughts on this. Because I've seen it, like, done with, like, a lot of other horror stories. So, if you give you some time to sit back, relax, get some snacks, some drinks. And let's get started. <clears throat> this is My Little Pony Season 5 True Friendship. Everyone has heard of My Little Pony Friendship's magic. At some point, regardless whether or not they were brony or... Alright, hold on, I, I screwed up, I accidentally almost said, like, of, I, I was reading the of course and didn't see the I. Everyone has heard of My Little Pony Friendship's magic. At some point, regardless whether or not, there are a brony. I, of course, am a brony myself, and I have watched every episode, all the sorts, and all of the Equestria Girls movies. To, to take a little, like, point out this, I watched the fourth one, the forest one, when we went camping. I liked it. I'm not a brony. I just think the writing's good. And and there's some good jokes in there. I saw an episode of Rick and Morty in it. And they were like in the background. Who what kid's gonna say, look mom, Rick and Morty? Okay, anyway. <laughs> While waiting for season five, I'd been slowly drifting away from it and was more focused on other stuff. When season five did eventually come out, I was excited and watched every episode that came out. Wait. I'm going to read that again. It seemed like... 
it seemed did it say like come out like diff- two times when season five eventually came out i was excited and watched every episode that came out yeah look that's weird i don't know i loved every episode despite its flaws i especially love the 100th episode making it my favorite episode of all time i personally like that one all right getting back to the story i'm not gonna interrupt anymore However, recently the show decided to go on a hiatus again during the middle of the season. And at the time I'm writing this, it's still on its hiatus. Wow, that sucks. I was very mad. What? Oh my gosh, what's that? No, go away. Freaking ads. Also, if there's like swearing in here, I might have to block these for not for kids because I am going to try my hardest to make the swears not sound like swears so I was very mad why would they suddenly go on a hiatus again after the long wait and we had to go through wait we had okay I think I screwed that on whatever most of my friends said it might have to do with the new Equestria Girls movie but they won't excuse the fact that they recently sewed the finale off at the convention meaning that they could still make the other episodes. I'm sorry. I, it's 3 o'clock in the morning, as you guys can see. I am... I'm not sleepy, but I'm out of it. Because it's like 3 o'clock in the morning. I've got food and drinks waiting for me. And I've got them next to me by the time I'm done writing this. I'm going to eat them. I went out of my way to find the reasons behind it. But found nothing. However, I wish I could have just left the reason alone. I wonder what happened. One Sunday morning, I went on my computer and booted up Skype. I saw that one of my friends, whom I'll call Danny, messaged me an hour ago. Danny said was horrified. he was horrified by what he saw. I was confused and asked him what he was talking about. He wouldn't say what he was talking about, so I asked him if I could see what he was talking about. It took me a few minutes until he finally gave in and gave me a media file media fire link to an episode why did we fire us fire whatever i was surprised by what i saw it was named my little pony friends of his magic episode 14 true friendship i asked him where he got this and he said he got it off youtube i'm gonna look that up after this apparently the video was almost instantly removed by hasbro never mind i won't but he managed to download it quickly At the time, I thought a hacker must have hacked them or something, because when I looked on YouTube, I found nothing of the episode. I thanked him, but he didn't respond back. He's probably dead. His status was set on a way, and I just thought he had to go somewhere. I then proceeded to open the video, but I saw the episode was shorter than normal episodes. The average episode is 22 minutes long, but it was... But here, it's about 16 minutes. I was confused for a moment. But then I thought, maybe the hacker couldn't get the whole episode since it was, wasn't was finished. And had to upload what he had. I was a bit doubtful this was an actual episode. And was beginning to think this was some fan of some, some brony. I started it off and clicked play on the video. Hey, we get pictures. Snaps of opening up episodes. It looks normal to me. I've seen that logo way too many times. I do have a sister after all, so... The first thing I noticed was there was nothing for the first few seconds until the intro with the theme song... With the theme song came on. Okay, I'm gonna read that again, I'm sorry. The... Hey, Tony Hawk's done. Sweet. I can't... Uh, turn the, the noise off my PlayStation, but the golf game noises off the first one I noticed that there was the first one I noticed was there was nothing for the first few seconds until the intro with the theme song came on until the intro with the oh until okay there was nothing till the theme okay I understand now I'm just reading these wrong I guess I found it odd but then go away I found it odd but then I remember it probably wasn't finished the episode looked like it was filmed on a VHS tape since the video and sound quality was bad. The answer was the same as the season 1 intro, just without Twilight's library in the background. Wait, is there Twilight's? No, it's probably like a different frame. Regardless, the episode went by as normal, 
until I ended. There was nothing again for a few seconds until it abruptly cut into the episode. It sewed the front of Twilight's new castle for about 20 seconds. There was no sound or title card. It was just a still shot of the castle. I then cut the Twilight Spoker lying on her bed crying. I'd never seen Twilight so depressed like this. Neither have I. In fact, the crying sounded like Tara Strong was actually crying. We're getting into the whole, like, voice actors being actually the press we're recording great. I don't know where the sword's going. Pinkie Pie was slowly... Pinkie Pie had been slowly walked up to her. She wasn't her normal happy self, but I came to know and love. This dude's in love with ponies. This dude's in love with ponies. Or just... I guess love doesn't... Whatever. Shut up, I'm just... My brain's going all over places. She asked Twilight what was wrong, and Twilight looked over at Pinky slowly. Spike is dead, she said. I was sucked by what she said. Not only was the fact that a main character actually died, it was that they never talk about death directly. That was me face palming. We're getting into this character is dead. Great. Flourside did say to Rainbow Dash that Tank was going going to die if he didn't hibernate and tanks for the me- I haven't seen that one and tanks for the memories but she didn't mention the word di- I'm gonna look that up right after this I want to hear her say that the thing's gonna die I would mention the word death or anything like that also in Crusader the Lost Mark Applejack hints that her parents are dead but doesn't say the word death in any way picture flashed on screen before it cut to the next scene but I didn't att- attempt to see what it was since I can't pause it fast enough. Next scene so Twilight Sparkle slight silently walking down the road of Ponyville. She so wasn't crying anymore but she looked more depressed. Her cutie mark was gone and there was no sound other than the sound of her hoof steps. I wonder what's going to happen. There were no background ponies, and the background looked like it was a drawn. It was drawn on a paper, on a paper, drawn on a paper, not drawn on paper, drawn on a paper, and used over and over for the walk cycle. The walk cycle lasted for twenty. For, oh, sorry. What the heck am I doing? For two minutes until the background changed to what it might look like in the show. I don't know. This grammar sucks. So I stopped to notice he was a bit grayer than before. The camera panned over to destroy the room, but Tara Tyrick Tyrion Ty Tyrick Junkrat Tyrick How do you say that word? I'm a I'm a translate. What is this word? Uh, Tyrek? Tyrek? I don't know. It stayed like that for a minute until it cut to the back. It stayed like that for 10 seconds until cutting back to the castle. Oh no, we got another picture down there. Flos, I walked to Twilight's bedroom door and knocked on it. Twilight, can you come out here for a sec? I can't read. If that is o- if that's okay for you, she said, unsure about this. At first, it sounded like there was no response until I heard muffling, muffling from the other side. I turned the volume up and kept listening to it. I heard Twilight repeating the words "friendship isn't magic" over and over again. It sounded like she was going insane. Flossie was also hearing the same thing and slowly backed away scared. What kind of episode is this? I thought to myself, this isn't for kids. Snaps out of the scene of Rainbow Dash looking stressed and looking around the picture ended up being distorted. What? The next scene showed Rainbow Dash in the sky flying around and clearing clouds as normal until she stopped. She looked around looking very uneased as like she thought she was being watched. The camera switched to a different position as Rainbow Dash continued to look around, but now the sky was black. 
the clouds were still there, but the sky was black as if it was nighttime. Rainbow Dash then flew away off camera. The scene stayed like this for about a minute, giving me an unnerving feeling that there was something else to this scene. At the last few seconds, I saw a gray figure flying towards the camera. <laughs> I looked more closely and figured at the figure and realized it was Twilight. So it kept flying towards the camera until she was right up to it. It then got the black with a faint buzzing. With a faint buzzing heard in the background for five seconds. This story sucks. How much longer do we have to go? Oh lord, look at all the... Look, look at how much longer there is. Oh, great. Okay. I'm, I'm going to stop being so... I'm going to try to, like, sp spruce up my acting and just keep going. I'm not going to, like, try to be zoned out and stuff. I'm just... I don't know. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. There was then a still picture of... Ponyville looking like it was abandoned. The sky was still black and there was the sound of wind in the background. It stayed on this for 20, for 40 seconds until it cut to the front of Twilight's castle again and the sky is still black. The scene changed to the inside of Twilight's castle and the camera panned around selling different rooms slowly. There was a narration, but I get back on. There was also a narration, but I get, I get back on that in a bit. What I saw was horrifying. It's so the main six except for Twilight, all cut up and mutilated. Oh, how'd they die? How'd they die? Oh, I guess it shows right down there. They were all discolored as well, meaning they were dead. It's so stupid. Each room had a had each character. Of the main five in them as the camera pans slowly. Did I mention I watched My Little Pony just because I think it's good? I think I did. The first room showed Pinky and Rainbow Dash laying on the ground. Pinky's head was gone and nowhere to be found in the scene. She had cuts all over her body and was bleeding cartoon blood because, of course, she was. Rainbow Dash had her wings snapped and she had a large gash in her chest. She was apparently hit by a cleaver in the head, which was the cause of her death. The second room showed Fluttershy, Rarity, and Applejack. Rarity had her jaw and horn broken off. There was a knife left deep within her eye. Ow, dang. Applejack had her back legs torn off and had a gash on her head. There was a hole where her heart would be. Am I getting flagged for this? <laughs> Fluttershy had her wings ripped off and looked like she was beat to death, having sev several stab wounds around her. I watched in horror trying to risk the urge to puke. What the heck kind of episode is this, I thought. As mentioned earlier, there was an narration going on in the background by Twilight Sparkle as the scene played out. I didn't catch on to what she said, and I didn't want to rewatch the scene. I'd watch this episode. No, for, for laughs. I decided to go back earlier in the scene and minimize the video so I won't have to see the scene again. Dear Princess Celestia, Twilight said, words echoing around, Friendship isn't magic. I have been living a lie. True friendship will will be able to prevent such happenings. That wasn't the case for me. My true friends didn't prevent what happened at all. Life is just a lie in the end. Your friends will just backstab you and leave. So here's the question. What is true friendship? I was tearing up slightly when she was done talking. I opened the video back up and the camera was still panning slowly. It came up to one room where it showed the letter Twilight wrote. The camera panned slowly to show Twilight hanging from a noose dead. She had se several cuts on her body and was discolored. <sighs> Did 
The camera stopped and stayed on Twilight's hanging body for the rest of the episode. I thought that wasn't the end, so I quickly skipped to the last few things of the episode. Because of course you do that when there's a weird episode going on. All it sewed was just static. I went back to, before the static happened, Twilight was still hanging from a noose, but there was one frame of one, a picture before cutting a to static. I opened up a video editor so I can go through the frames. I decided to go to the first frame from earlier when Twilight was crying. It was a picture of Spike with both of... Both of... <laughs> <laughs> that phrasing that phrasing it was a picture of Spike with both of arms ripped off his eyes gouged out and a heart torn out the blood looked more detailed in this shot than the other from later that freaking both of arms <laughs> that's so stupid I once again resist the urge to puke and skip to the point to where it cuts the static what I saw scared me it was a picture of Twilight close up to the camera looking like she was screaming and had realistic bloodshot human eyes surrounded. The eyes was pure black like staring into a void. She was still discolored like she was still dead. Sorry, let me let me rephrase that. Let me rephrase that. Let me rephrase that. Twilight was close up to the camera looking like she was screaming and had realistic bloodshot human eyes surrounding the eyes was pure black like starting like staring into a void. She was still just code like she was still dead. That's way better. Is that the picture? It's an episode of the last frame of the episode. Once again, this picture is distorted. No matter what I do, I will always end up this way. Of course. Because stupid. My heart is pounding. I didn't know what to do. Well, what to say? I quickly checked. I quickly checked Skype and saw that Danny was back online. I was quick to ask questions on the episode. He responded saying that he knows the reason on why the episode was made. Apparently, Hasbro hired a new writer for the show, but the writer was insane and didn't believe in friendship. Oh no! He then went on to writing an episode about it. The guy. <sighs> The guy was also an animator, which is how he managed to animate the episode. The voice actors had no idea what they were getting into once they were voicing, once they were voicing for the episode. Everyone at Hasbro rejected his episode idea. Once the new writer sold the script, he still went on to animating the ep to animating the episode and uploaded it on YouTube. Hasbro quickly took took it down took down the videos. But the main the, the man was nowhere to be found. You spoke nowhere wrong, by the way, I think. Shortly after the video was taken down, I am still in shock of what I just saw. I still wished I would have never out on why I wish I would never Oh my grammar Arr. I am still in shock of what I just saw. I still wished I would have never found out on the why they would suddenly go on a hiatus. I still have the video on my hard drive. I am unsure if I am going to upload it on YouTube. And that's the end. There are four comments. What do the comments say? In response to it, it isn't real. These stories. Well, wow, this should be uploaded. It's so good. Nope. Can't you just... You spoke camera. It's C-A-N apostrophe T. You just send it to us, to it to some of us. Because I'm kind of curious to see it. It isn't real. These stories are fixing. Upload it no matter what happens. If I watch it, nothing bad will happen. It isn't real. Stories are fixing. Of course they are. And of course, My Little Pony videos. And of course, we got Spongebob Squarepants. Which... I don't know. That that was My Little Pony, the friendship thing, whatever. Uh, f final rating. Dog crap. 
dog crap. That was stupid. Didn't like it. No, no. Go away. Don't want to touch the store again. It was fine. This seems like a video or a store that would... Hey, Trixie, what's going on? This seems like a story that would make people, like, rage on YouTube. Let's see if we can type up more. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the crap is that? I am... I am spreading the magic. <laughs> yep. Oh my gosh, that's... Oh no, that's creepy. What... Well, it looks like a horror story, dude. Oh no. Uh. Okay. Oh hi, what's up? Uh. What's up? That's cool. It's like a Evil Dead. That's cool. I don't like this one. Okay, what character is this? I watch the show, but not that much. M Mommy's still pretty. I sound dirty for saying that. Whoa, Pinky. What's going on? You look like a Five Nights at Freddy's character. Okay, we're done. We are done. What's up? We we're done. How how I, I type my little pony creepypasta pause. This shows up. Yeah, this is scary. Is that the turtle that died? I don't know, probably. Rainbow Factory. Fluttersai. Questria. Oh, yes. My Little Pony. Creepypasta. And I find Starlight Glamour. And Princess Celestia. That's not Princess Celestia. <laughs> okay, we're done. That was a fun video. Maybe I'll read more horror stories. If you guys have any horror stories you want me to read, like, there's, there's a lot of them. There's, like, Blue's Clues ones. There's, I don't know. I'll try to, f oh, yeah, season one, episode zero, though. Oh, we need to we need to read that one. We'll read that one after this, so that, that'll, that'll be fun. Give me suggestions on stuff to, to do. That'll be fun. Smile song, huh? Not gonna get copyright claimed, am I? The Smile Song is a song featured in the episode of Friend of Need. Like that episode. Okay, we're done. This was this is stupid. I don't want to keep going. This is just this is really dumb. The grammar sucked in the story.